could not be good news for many brokers who might have to have longer working hours in a bear market. A discussion paper issued by the regulator SEBI or Securities and Exchange Board of India today suggests that the market should be aligning itself with other international markets and therefore we should have extended trading hours. Vijay Ayer gauges the response of those in the trade and the likely implications of such a move. 8 to 8 or 8 to 4 or 9 to 5. The trading hours for equities of 10 to 4 on Indian bourses may soon be history. But not all are pleased with the prospect. Parak Shah of Sher Khan is among those who believe this will require stronger back-end infrastructure and a stretch of human resources. Definitely, you know, it would be an uh, overhang on uh, Sher Khan and visa vis all the broking houses when it comes to increasing the timing. So, you know, number of people have to increase and all that thing. Uh, definitely, you would need a bigger infrastructure is what currently plays. So, that would again incur a cost. SEBI's discussion paper sees a need to extend timings to align with international markets. This even as it takes note of the likely pressures on brokers. It has set an April 10 deadline for responses. SEBI contends the objective of floating a discussion paper is to gauge the mood of participants. But many see it as a response to NSE's proposal to advance FNO trading to ATM. NSE has been looking to snatch trading revenues from the Singapore exchange which starts trade in the SGX Nifty at 8 a.m. There is no end to this. Today Singapore starts at a time corresponding to 8 o'clock. Tomorrow if Nifty or Sensex is allowed on the New York Stock Exchange, are we going to keep the market open for 24 hours? Is it possible? Any move to increase market hours will help investors guard against any big gap in the opening hours. But is 8 to 4 any better than 9 to 5 or 10 to 6 is being driven by the interest of a single exchange and may make market regulator look a bit partial and hence SEBI is taking all the efforts to ensure transparency. In Mumbai, Vijay Ganeshan for NDTV Profit.